hi guys and welcome to my channel so today i'm making a very simple pizza recipe so let's get this started so to start with i'm going to add two and a half cups of flour then i'm going to add two teaspoons of sugar and i'm also going to add one and a quarter teaspoon of salt mix this together and then on the side i have one and a half teaspoon of yeast and one cup of lukewarm water i'm just going to add the yeast to the water give it about five minutes and then pour it into the dry ingredients So I'm just going to mix this up, make the dough. Then once the dough is ready, I'm just going to put some oil on a bowl and then put the dough and cover it for about one hour to two hours to just give it time to raise. So guys, the next thing is to make the sauce. So what I do for the sauce is just get about four tomatoes and then I'm going to steam them a bit so that I can be able to peel out the skin. So once I peel out the skin, the next thing I just blend these up, but I'm going to add two cloves of garlic. So I blend these up together and then I'm going to put it on a pan and uh, let it boil so that it can become more thick. And to this sauce, I'm going to add some basil and some oregano. So as the sauce gets ready, the next thing is to now grate some cheese. And then I'm also going to add some nyama bite. I wanted to use, uh, use pepperoni, but I didn't have pepperoni. So this is what I'm going to be using. So by this time, the dough is ready. It has risen. So what I'm going to do is just cut it into two parts, equal parts, then prepare it again and then cover it for about 10 minutes, leave it to raise a bit again and then now it's ready to use. This is going to make me two medium pizzas. So what I do is put some maize meal flour on the bottom of the tray and some oil just to prevent it from sticking and the maize meal flour is really going to help the, the crust be a bit crunchy. So spread it out and then add the sauce, then add all the other toppings and your pizza is ready to go to the oven. Now it's time to bake it. I'm going to bake it at 240 degrees Celsius for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the crust is nice and golden. The pizza is almost ready. I'm going to rub some garlic oil around the crust just to give it a little bit more flavor. That's it guys. The pizza is ready. It's time to taste it and it really does taste awesome. Give it a try and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and thank you so much guys for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye.